Uber. <laughs> So I am back in Providence. I've actually already done a Providence vlog and yeah, I also wanted to show you guys because whenever I visit my bestie, um, we always do a book exchange except this time I was kind of crappy and didn't bring any books. A little apartment warming gift from Prague so I'm not a complete asshole. Ta -ta. And then come, 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 we will do, we will do uh, the books. First of all, she got me this, the Practical Witches box set, which is very cute. I'm not sure what it is, but I'm very excited. Ooh, it's like, it's a it's a guy. That's amazing. It's exactly what it says it is. <laughs> um, so I'll start with the ones that she is returning to me. Um, first of all, The Hole by Hiroko Oyamada. Um, she did not like this one. And it's very short, so at least if you don't like it, it's not a long read of <laughs> something you hate. Um, also, Yukio Mishima, which she liked but didn't... I like. I didn't like the the writing style, but once I learned more about the author and his experience and what happened with him, it. it... Hello. So when I was editing this part of the video, I realized that mm, well, some of my footage was missing. So I'm coming back and refilming. I can't remember everything that we were talking about. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. The other two books are uh, Breasts and Eggs. She didn't. She just was not able to get into this, which could be because of like life work circumstances but i get it i this book literally took me years to finish because i started it and then i stopped so i totally and completely respect that someone would not be able to jump in dive in and like really really enjoy this book so if you're having difficulty with this book take your time don't feel like you have to finish it in one go uh and next up is yukio mishima i think if i remember correctly she enjoyed this but she didn't necessarily love love it it was just kind of like yeah it's a good book She's okay, she can hang. Um, and I really like this book, so two opinions, two, two perspectives. And then she uh, lent me the following. Um, the first one is Time as a Mother by Ocean Bong. I really want to read, not in general, but I just, like, just want to read more poetry, but also, I don't know, I feel like there's something very beautiful in poetry that I'm thinking about. Like I, I like poetry in the way that it makes me think about the world around me. And so I'm very excited to get this. I actually also just got um, one of Hanif Abdurakib's, I have another book by him somewhere here. I got one of his poetries and I'll talk about that later um, in a different video. But yeah, so more poetry in my life. She also um, gave me, slash lent to me, the Butterfly Garden by Dot Hutchinson. And this I think was a, this was, oh, I, I know this was like a book club pick for her, for a book club that she's a part of. And I remember it being kind of creepy, but interesting, kind of a three star book, but like, if you're gonna like it, you're gonna like, you know what I mean? Like a comfort three stars where if you just want to read something that will be easy and digestible, this is that. And then the last book, this is very interesting. So it's If Egyptian Cannot Speak English by Noor Naga. And um, this book we actually both got together at 21 Stories last time I was in Providence. And it was so funny because we were talking to each other at some point and she was telling me, she's like, oh, this is a three-star book. And she's just talking about it. And then as we're talking more and more about the book, she's like, wow, this book is like becoming a five-star book as I'm talking about it with you. And I think she settled on this being a five-star book. And to me, I think that's something about about books that's so interesting is the way that we, the way that we engage with literature can actually change our understanding of it. And sometimes the book can be like thematically five stars, but the story is is three stars, but the writing is four. Stars. Like like the way that we understand this, it's so layered, and it's kind of hard to compress into one rating and sometimes you have to kind of acknowledge well this book has faults but there's something that this book gave me that was good enough that i'm going to very highly rate it with the understanding that the next person over might not have that experience with this book but yeah so i think the books that she gave me just because of like my end of the year reading plans might get pushed into next year but they're all very good and enjoy the rest of the video Fries. The everything fries, is that what you get? Yeah. Should I get mac and cheese or should I get a sandwich? Well, you said you wanted something hot, right? 
Oh, the sandwich is not hot. This is fried chicken sandwich. Like fried oh, I thought you meant like comfort food. Like a pasta or soup or something. I make my own soup a lot. Leek soup. I make leek soup. <laughs> God, he's truly dressed like a, a gentleman of, of the Venetian waterways. For sure. We're waiting for water fire. We arrived only slightly early. Three hours early. Only three hours early. We've seen a couple of ducks. There's wood down there and it's hidden. And we're celebrating the veterans. Yay. Yay. It's hunger. It's like, normally I eat, but I don't have like a, a thought process about it. It's like, ah, oh, it's time to eat. Like I have that type of like normal amount of hunger, but recently I've had the hunger where I'm like thinking and excited and like planning food and I've never had that before. Like Julia Child. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> the tripper. Is that Julia Child? I think so. It's a very new experience. That building is fake. Yeah, we don't believe in it. We, we don't believe in that building. building. Look at the ducks. Look at the ducks. These are ducks. They are Mallard. friends. And or mallards. <laughs> and or mallards. Well, there's definitely mallards. I see, I count them. One, two, three, four, five. There's three couples and then there's two single males. <gasps> oh no. The social upheaval will begin. <laughs> I was very close to bleaching my eyebrows the other week. Yay, water fire! Fire, water fire. Water fire! Yay! <laughs> Yay. <laughs> 